while active duty Navy ships dock in San Pedro to flex their military might. Gil Reyes reports from the sold out LA Navy days. Visitors lucky enough to snag tickets before they sold out got a chance to climb aboard and check out the gun show. Just the fact that it was for families and I just want to educate my son about the military and how they support our country and protect our country and, and basically let him know that these are the superheroes, the real superheroes of our world. Thousands of visitors showed up at the LA Harbor for LA Navy days. That's where three active duty Navy ships docked temporarily for public tours. Modern American sea power up close. So if you guys look to the rear, or if you look at this uh, system right here, it's the VLS vertical launching system. All right, it just uh, fires a bunch of missiles. Uh, you have a missile for just about everything. You have anti-air, anti-sub. The visiting vessels included two guided missile cruisers from San Diego, the USS Bunker Hill and the USS Cape St. George. Also docked, the guided missile destroyer, the USS Halsey from Pearl Harbor. My girlfriend's son is actually uh, going to be on, which, what's the The ship? USS Halsey is going to be Halsey. reporting in, in Pearl Harbor when it, when it goes over there. So we're looking forward to seeing these amazing ships. And I'll get to see it before he does. A family affair for sure on board these maritime models of military might. At the Port of L.A., Gil Reyes for L.A. This Week. Though the visiting vessels have sailed home, the port's very own USS Iowa and Lane Victory are open on most days for museum tours.